New tonight, two parents in Gwinnett County want the school administrator disciplined. They say the principal is responsible for breaking her son's leg during a fight. 11 Alive's Karis Belger joins us live right now from W.J. Cooper Elementary School. So, Karis, what are the parents talking about that tonight? Well, the boy's mother, Dr. Lisa Shell, tells me that she specifically chose the school because she thought her son, who has ADHD and autism spectrum disorder, would have the best educational opportunities. But after this incident, she says she's regretting her choice. Dr. Lisa Shell says she feels guilty about what happened to her son. These people that I trusted with my son and I work with, these are my coworkers. Her nine-year-old's leg was broken in the behavior recovery room at W.J. Cooper Elementary, where she also works. She says the principal is the one responsible. He didn't say anything until we were actually walking out the door. And I'm like, why are you still limping? And he said, um, because Mr. Willis stomped on my leg. She shared this video of her son. She says she took after the incident. What happened when you went for the door? That's why he pinned me. Dr. Shell's son now has a broken tibia. He needs crutches and this scooter to get around. An email from Principal Willis says Lisa's son, quote, physically attacked a classmate before being taken to a behavior recovery room before hitting, kicking, and biting the principal. Her son is currently suspended from Cooper Elementary, but she says she doesn't even know if she wants him to go back. And aside from what happened to her son now, Dr. Shell tells me she is concerned about what may happen with her employment at Cooper Elementary as well. All right, Karis, thank you so much.